So, what is Greg's first choice? <laughs> the Kardashians. <laughs> Thank you and goodbye. <laughs> um, I thought we'd start big. <laughs> it's hard to know where to start, really. I suppose my biggest gripe is not the fact that, that Kim Kardashian has released a book of selfies mm. um, called Selfish, <laughs> or that she has released a, an app game that you can do where you have to go from uh, the E list to the A list, and that's how you complete the game. That's annoying. Take it from me, it's a very long game. <laughs> I've given <laughs> half my life to it. <laughs> <laughs> so those, those are two annoying things. But right. the, the thing for me is that when I was growing up, we used to watch rubbish telly and look at rubbish reality, reality stars and go, oh, they're, they're embarrassing, aren't they? But we didn't want to be them. But whereas now with the Kardashians, people seem to watch it and go, well, they're idiots, aren't they? But I quite want to be like her. <laughs> and it feels like there's a lot of particularly young girls that want to be like the Kardashian girls, and uh, for that reason, I'm going to try and put them into Room 101. Oh. <laughs> because... But because... The thing is, I think, I just think, I think we need better, better role models, OK? So I've, I've actually got a list of, of role models who are better than the Kardashians. Would you like to hear the list? Well, it's okay. a... It's, it's a 29-minute show, you see. <laughs> A list of better role models than the Kardashians. One, literally everyone else in the world, apart from murderers, but even then you can argue at least they have done something and have some skills. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. And that's, that's kind of as far as I've got, really.